Recently, Donald Trump lawyer Christina Bob went back to her old hangout, her old employer of the One America News Network, which if you're like me, you're kind of shocked to learn that holy crap, they're still there. Uh, I had predicted earlier this summer, by the end of the year, they may not exist anymore, but hey, God love them. They're still out there producing shows, even though they're not actually on any network in the United States. So they're making content. It's going out there. They just... They don't even know where it's going at this point. But anyway, Trump lawyer, Christina Bob goes on there to talk about Carrie Lake's idiotic lawsuit against the state of Arizona, trying to overturn the 2022 election results. And she's asked actually a very simple question, but without getting, giving too much away, take a look at Christina Bob, Donald Trump's lawyer, basically showing us how delusional and stupid she really is. Here it is. Kerry wins this one, becomes governor, but it proves that Arizona is screwed. Does Trump have any yep. legal standing to go back and go, this is the same system they screwed me at in 2020? Just a question. Yes or no? Uh, well, it'll be interesting. <laughs> uh, you know, I, I don't know. I mean, one state, as we know, we would need three states. I so I, I wouldn't necessarily say right away, certainly maybe down the road, but I, I would expect Governor Lake to clean up the process. Huh. Now, the fun part about this is that Christina Bob didn't have to say anything and she could have given the correct answer, which the correct answer to his question of, Oh, will this open the door for Trump to challenge? The correct answer for that is no, no. What are you, an idiot? Th- this is the dumbest thing I've, I've ever heard. Why are you even asking me that question? And here's why it's the dumbest thing ever. And this is why Christina Bob is in my opinion, one of the worst lawyers ever. The two cases are not the same. So there, there wouldn't be precedent on one, even, even if Carrie Lake was successful, which she will not be again, still shocked. It hasn't already been laughed out of court. Legal experts, election experts have already ripped this lawsuit apart. I talked about that last week um, because it is so stupid. They in fact said it was actually poorly written. Like that's how bad it is. Like the, the wording is stupid. So she's not going to win, but let's assume for a second, let's say she did win. Even if she were to win, it wouldn't set a legal precedent for Donald Trump and his legal team with Christina Bob on it to march into Arizona and have the same kind of victory because it would be two completely different sets of circumstances because Carrie Lake, even though she mentioned a lot of Trump's claims from 2020 in her lawsuit, isn't suing over the same claims that Donald Trump has made about Arizona with his challenges. So it's a completely different set of circumstances, a completely separate set of facts. And Christina Bob as a lawyer should have understood that. And she actually could have explained it. Like, well, uh, maybe it will. We'll have to wait and see. But, you know, we have to get three other states too, which, you know, we'll see. We could do that. You're, you're lying. You're lying to this man who works at the network that you used to work at. The correct answer was no. And here's why. And then you explain what I just explained. But you couldn't do that. And that is very concerning for somebody that actually has a law license to get out legal maneuvered by a dude that doesn't have one. But I just did that. And there you go. There's a different, another scenario I want to point out too. Either she just totally fumbled that question or, and this may be more likely in my opinion, She's genuinely that stupid and doesn't understand it. That's the thing that should actually worry Donald Trump. If she genuinely believes the answer that she gave, then dude, you're going to jail because that's your lawyer and somebody that stupid shouldn't be representing the former president of the United States who could be looking at multiple different criminal charges on multiple different cases. And she's the one equipped in your mind to defend you from it, which again means that if it comes down to it, if it all rests on Christina Bob's shoulders, you're going to end up in jail. Hey everyone, this is Aspen. And did you know that for the low, low cost of $0 per day, you can subscribe to the fair and balanced YouTube channel. We also encourage you to like comment and share, but again, click that subscribe button. 
and help Aspen oh. not be so grumpy.